Do you have the reports, police reports? Um, I actually yeah. have the recordings. Yeah, I, I would actually like to see the report if you have it. I have numerous reports. Um, the one that came in at 110. The one at 110, they did not give me, but this one at, on 11-3, it does specify that I did report it, and they came back out to see my dog. It does have the date of 1031 highlighted on there. Just a second. This date is what date? 11-3, I called animal control. Three days later. Yes, the incident happened on Saturday. Then I waited until Monday to take my dog to the vet and yeah, had to go to work and called animal control and the police station. And it states the 31st it happened. I'd like to see the vet's write-up because you claimed that your dog was bitten. I'd like to see that. The picture? I'd see any evidence that you have of a dog bite and the vet's report. There's all the pictures. No, 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 just show me the just picture there. of the dog's injury and the vet report. Okay, vet report. Here's the report. Oh, this wasn't a bite. This is not a picture of a bite. Let's understand each other. The vet did surgery, but the vet did surgery on this dog for something else. Uh, no, I have a prior picture of the abscess on that that swelled up. I want to see a picture on the 31st of a dog bite on your dog's face. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? I completely understand what you're well, saying Well, then to let's me. get to it. That's, there was no blood. It has, if you look at the bottom of the report of the vet bill, it does state that it was a puncture wound on the face of the dog. And that's what swelled up. Well, there was, there was just no blood. I need a report from a vet that shows me, certainly this doesn't show any injury to the dog. I don't see any injury to the dog. Am you I can't missing see something? The swelling I'm, on the side. Am I missing something? Do you see any injury to the dog? I don't really, I just see swelling on that side. Swelling. At the bottom of the vet bill, it states that it was from a puncture wound. I see what's typed in here. Yes. In yeah. a different type than the rest of the report. That's from the Do Mays Animal Hospital. You I, could call him directly if you wanted I'm to. I'm not going to call him directly. I, I didn't add that on there. I'm not going to call him directly. You have a police report? Did you pay this fine, Miss Morris? No, I did not. Why? Because they're false. <laughs> well, the thing is, he, he never comes out. I never get a warning. I just get the fines in the mail. I appealed it. And what happened? They assessed the order, and I tried to appeal the order. They keep on refusing my appeal. So for the you order. have to pay this fine. <laughs> Your dogs can't be out. Well, they weren't out. They were actually they, in the Jeep with me. No, they weren't. <laughs> they weren't in the Jeep with you. They yeah. were out of your control on oh. at least two occasions because I'm not sure about the nexus between the abscess that the dog had mm -hmm. and what happened with your dog. I'm not sure because certainly if I had dogs that I loved, like you love your dogs, and my dog was bitten on a Saturday, I would not wait till Monday to go to a vet. I was unemployed. I don't care. On Monday you went, what, did you get a job my between mother... Saturday and Monday? <laughs> no, my mother paid for it. She would have paid for it on Saturday too. Be, you yeah. went, <laughs> you know, you have an answer for everything. Just like your mom paid for it on Monday, she mom would have paid for it on Sunday. I know. Oh, I know. ER's so, expensive. So that doesn't do it for me. Okay. 